I was contacted late in the day yesterday by the um, by the governor's office, um, suggesting the possibility of having Antalan move to the old Tijin campus. JFK, where JFK. Where JFK used to be. The old Cortec campus in Tizen. Until June, it was occupied by JFK High School before JFK moved into their new campus at the start of this school year. I got in contact with Jim Rages, who's the current principal, and I said, you know, there's this possibility. Um, you know, we don't want to impact school, and so, you know, you need to put together a plan if, if um, things happened uh, and, and you are given the opportunity to move to Tijin. In June, after JFK left, the governor's office had announced that the lease with Cortec would be canceled. But then that decision was rescinded after lawmakers and the governor talked about the need for new legislation to allow the Tijin campus to continue to be used for either GovGuam office space or to harbor another school. But why move Untalan and not some other school? As you might recall, the governor visited Untalan about a month ago and was concerned about the, um, you know, the, the facilities. However, Titano emphasized no final decision has been made to move Untalan yet. There's been no def definitive um, uh, decision made. Um, in my mind, the decision needs to be a joint one between our board, you know, who has, uh, you know, by law, the, you know, the authority to close schools. Um, the I think the legislature might need to be involved if there's funding issues because, you know, of course, to, you know, someone would need to pay the rent. And that's the big issue. Board member Barry Mead pointed out, as of now, there are no funds. Uh, the problem for the Department of Education in being able to do that is who's going to pay the rent? Then the other thing is who's going to pay for the repairs to the school? So the question would be, okay, it'd be fine if we move on to lot, but how long will it sit? before it's able to be uh, repaired, because it's going to be an expensive repair. Whether the move happens or not, it will still take some time and couldn't be done before school resumes on January 3rd. What is it going to take? How many days do we need? Um, you know, there, I mean, moving a campus is a big, is a big endeavor. Not going to happen in a week. Well, and so, th I mean, and it can't happen without sufficient planning. Kevin Kerrigan, PNC News.